Hello again. Today we are going to discuss how we can clear this Excel sheet data with the help of Invoke VB activity. So for that first we will create a process and we'll give it a name Invoke VBA. So this is our main file. First, I will take an Excel application scope. And I need to give a path of that Excel file for which I want to run this VBA code. So this is the path. Now I will disable this thing so that it will not create a new one if I don't have the Excel file over here. Okay, now I will take a invoke VBA. So I took the invoke VBA. The invoke VBA required two inputs. The first one is the VBA file and the second one is the function or subroutine. So for that, I will create a text file and give it a name VBA code. You can give any name over here. Now I have to write my subroutine or you can say function. So this is my VBA function. Sheets and I need to give a sheet name over here. So which sheet I want to clear this sheet I want to clear. So I will copy the name and paste it over here. clear and now I need to end the subroutine or you can say close the function save it control s and close it now I need the file so I hope it will be visible the file will be visible over here yep the file is here now my function so my function name is in this file my function name is clear sheet okay so I can copy paste the function name over here so my function name is clear sheet yep now I can run the process so I will run it and I'm expecting an ev error over here yep this is the error so if you also getting this error that means what you need to do is you need to close your Excel file first open your Excel application go to your options trust center click on trust center setting click on macro setting and you need to enable your trust access to the VBA project object model and just press OK OK and close this Excel now you can see this is my Excel file once I run this process, okay, so you can see it has cleared my sheet without deleting my sheet. Thank you. See you next time. Bye bye.